Riders, how you doing? I'm back. This is a ride home review. Sorry about last week. We had a bit of a uh, technical um, thing going on. In other words, what that means is, uh, yeah, my wife took the hard drive, so all the stuff was on there. So here I am, uh, back again to do another review. This week I watched The Killing of a Sacred Deer. Um, which is uh, stars Colin Farrell, Nicole Kidman, Barry Keough, uh, Alicia Silverstone, and a couple of fabulous kids that, for the most part, did really well. Uh, directed by Yorgos Lanthios. Um, and if you may not recognize that name, but if you ever saw the movie The Lobster, which also starred Colin Farrell, uh, he was the mastermind behind that, which was kind of a, a strange film in and of itself. Uh, well, this one, uh, the story is basically about a surgeon who uh, befriends the son of a patient he lost. And after introducing this, this the boy to his family, things take a strange turn. And there's more to that obviously uh, so what did I like about this film well first of all it it's a pretty original story I like the concept of, of what this was about um, and uh, it was really well done with the tension um, this is a thriller of some sort and so the tension was really well done the cinematography was excellent um, I really liked the long takes I really liked uh, the way the camera was methodically moving um, on the long shots and I just I just liked the simplicity of it and so I really thought that it was well done and and the performances for the most part were really good uh, but the concept was spot on it was original a very well original for a film not something it wasn't a sequel or prequel or spin-off or anything like that um, but yeah so so there was uh, there was that about it what I didn't care for was sometimes the sometimes the pacing was a, made it feel a little bit long um, and uh, it just it just dragged at some point in time and I know that they're trying to build tension but then it gets to points where it's like, all right, uh, let's 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 get a move on here. So I know that um, with with the lobster, Yorgos is a uh, movie that came out a couple years ago. I mean, I know it was the same way. Um, that was one of my my complaints about it was that sometimes the pacing was just a little too slow. Um, and then there's Alicia Silverstone, who was in the movie for a scene, and there was really no, but why? Why was it even necessary to have her in this role um, or as part of this film? It just didn't make sense to me. But um, all in all, uh, it was an okay movie. I wouldn't say it was, it was great. Um, it's a decent thriller. It has some tense moments. The music... Um, they do a good job with that. Um, um, you know, creatively it was uh, or shot really well. But um, what to watch for? Uh, Barry Keough, who I first saw on screen during Dunkirk, he is haunting as this as this kid whose father passed away. Um, he his performance is absolutely outstanding, and. Um, and it's just very, very, mm, I would say, it's just consistent. Very consistent through the whole film and did a good job. So, but all in all, I would wait to see this on Netflix or get it on a DVD. Um, if you like thrillers, if you like the, the lobster, you'll enjoy probably this, but it was all right. Anyway, once again, don't forget to like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, follow us on Instagram, and next week is the Murder on the Orient Express. Looking forward to it. We've got a special guest. Talk to you guys next week. Have a good one.